Hello, everybody. I am TD Jakes. Welcome to today's press event. Millions tuned in to last year's Seven Deadly Sins movies, Wrath and Greed, and ever since fans have been eagerly anticipating the next sin to be explored. This year, we're excited to present the fifth movie in our Seven Deadly Sins anthology, Pride, a Seven Deadly Sins story starring Stephanie Mills, Kia King, Thomas Miles, and Erica Campbell. An example of value-based entertainment at its best, this movie is not only a thriller, but also a cautionary tale that illustrates the dangerous and destructive nature of pride itself. In just a minute, the cast will be available to answer your questions, but before that, let me give you just a sneak peek at Pride, a Seven Deadly Sins story, and let me thank you for this moment we have together. Enjoy. Some crosses are too heavy to bear. Pride is dangerous. Good news. You're getting out. The grandma, help. The lady with that reality TV show? Welcome to Birdie's Bake. Cut. A Lifetime original movie. Is this some sick marketing point? I'm trying to keep our family name out of the mud. And a new deadly sin. Fuck a game. A lot of light. Good looking. Nose for trouble. This thing between you and Ella? It's perfect TV. Pride. That was amazing. Inspired by actual events. Well, when did you become this person? There's so much pressure. I got caught up in it. Stephanie Mills. I've been pumping your ass up all your life! Kia King. I am great for ratings. Thomas Miles. You too proud to let the world know you got a messed up son. Erica Campbell. Don't let pride destroy what destiny has ordained. Pride, a seven deadly sin story. Premiere Saturday, April 8th at 8, only on Lifetime. Hey guys, my name is Andrew from Visions TV Online. Thank you for the opportunity. I'm all the way from the UK and I oh. very much enjoyed the film. Thank you guys for having me online today. Um, so my question is for you today is what challenges did you have when preparing for your roles? So that's a, just a straight question for everybody. So who would like to go first? <laughs> mm. Who's first? I'll go first just to get out of the way because I can't believe I'm going to admit this. <laughs> but the biggest challenge for me actually was cooking. I, I can't cook. But Ella is a baker, a really beautiful, uh, exquisite baker because that, that runs in the family. Uh, Bertie runs a bakery. So everybody just knows how to bake and cook. Um, and I actually had to do a little preparing <laughs> uh, beforehand. So that was actually the biggest, one of the challenges for me is just how do I bake a cake? So at home, I got some eggs. I made like a little bitty crocker thing. And <laughs> that was one of my challenges. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. That's, well, I, I didn't have that much preparing to do because I'm a first lady of a church. So I understand kind of getting in the messes and the difficult stuff in families. Um, but I wanted it to still feel authentic to their situation and what they were dealing with and how I would really respond, you know, with those kind of personalities. And so, you know, hopefully I did my part justice, but it was wonderful to, to play that part with them. It was it was really intense, but powerful. Yes, Amazing. you did a great job. Thank I you. think the most thing is, is I don't bake either, so I don't. I don't. <laughs> I'm not a cook. <laughs> so that was that was a challenge for me, and just remembering my lines. That was a, just remembering what I'm doing. But then after I got there, it, it it became so organic. It just flowed, and and working with Kia and Erica and Tommy just made it made it so wonderful. Yeah, it was a wonderful I experience. I think my biggest challenge is I'm a I'm a perfectionist. So I I want to I want to nail it every single time. Mm -hmm. If I don't nail it, then I want to do it again and do it again. I want I want you to give me so many takes that until <laughs> I get it. I, if it was up to me, we'd still be in Vancouver shooting. <laughs> we'd still be there. <laughs> but I keep thinking, just give me one more. Just give me one more. And that's just always a, a big challenge for me is trying to perfect it and get it right. And then lastly, I just, I don't know, I felt like I was fat. I felt like I needed to drop him. Oh, I really? I like really? I yeah. Really? 
<laughs> my kids will tell me the truth. Wait till this comes out. <laughs> Your kids always will. That's true. Well, thank you very much for the opportunity. Um, Erica, I remember meeting you at Donna McCurkin's 60th birthday. You flew oh. over from London to, to, to his 60th. Um, yeah. Great opportunity to see you. Um, and hopefully we get to have you on Visions TV online once again. Let's do it. Amen. All right, God bless you all. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.